Good afternoon once again, Retriever fans, and welcome back to the UMBC Coaches Corner. I'm Dan Lahat. I'm once again joined by men's soccer coach, Coach Pete Karinji. Coach, welcome back. Thanks for having me. Short weekend last week, just the one game at UMass Law, but your boys got the job done, 2 nothing victory on the road. Yeah, it was, uh, it was a tough game. You know, UMass Law was playing really well. They were coming off with two great results. And anytime you play on the road in this league, um, it, it's a tough match, so I was just happy to get, <coughs> get out of there with the win. Now you get back home, wrap up the regular season at home. You already know you have a first round bye, but still that number one seed on the line with the win. Well, I think the way the league set up, you obviously you want to get the number one seed because you're guaranteed two home games. If you win the first one, I mean, you have to you have to win the semifinals. Um, but I, I think it's huge in this league because it's time to travel. Um, but you know, we know what we have to do, and we're going to play a very good Stony Brook team that needs to get a result also. So it's going to be a tough game. What's the league been like this year? Is it resembling past years, or is it kind of new with a, another team in there, increased competition? Well, I think you know, Boston University was a great program, and when we lost them, we lost a you know a, a national power. Um, but I think this UMass Lowell is a really good team. It's gotten better throughout the year. It's a credit to them and their coaching staff. Well, good luck uh, on Wednesday night against Stony Brook, and hopefully, we're talking about that first round by and then preparing for your semifinals after that. I appreciate it. So, once again, the Retrievers at home Wednesday night against Stony Brook at Retriever Soccer Park. Kickoff is scheduled for 7 p.m. For the Coach's Corner, I'm Dan Lohan.